The long-term monitoring that we've been doing has been mostly mostly in the Coxcomb Basin Wildlife Sanctuary. That um, that area has been monitored for approximately 16 years, with some years being skipped because of some reason. Um, the population there is stable. It's higher than any of the um, Mesoamerican populations that have been reported. Therefore, Belize together, which encompasses the Maya Mountains, up at an area, that, that is identified by literature as one of the strongholds for Jaguar population. And of course, we have the biggest part here. And because um, of the status of conservation that we have here, I, I, I would say that the population is very much uh, protected. Um, the other area that has been studied for a shorter period would be the area in central Belize, and um, partially, um, but that was years ago. These, the population there has been identified to be lower. Of course, there is a difference uh, there. That area has no protection, and there is a lot more of human uh, activities as in associated to the area. In terms of uh, manatee, um, they, we still only we haven't done that um, in a series of years, but the first year seems to be promising. Um, I can't say much because we need more data for it to, to for me to give a proper conclusion for the population of jaguars.